This is the staff groups help video. Here you're gonna see how to use staff groups. So staff groups are just a way of organizing your staff by a specific group. You can create staff groups like construction for just your construction staff, maintenance for just your maintenance staff. You could create a group for each crew if you wanted to break it down by that detail. Anything that'll help your foreman or your admin staff find employees faster by group. If you have less than 10 employees, you probably don't even need groups. If you have 50 employees, groups help filter down the list so that you can just see your maintenance staff or just see your construction staff or just your snow staff, etc. To create a new staff group, down on the bottom right is a staff group button. I'm going to click that and all you need to do is name your staff group. So for example, if I wanted to call one mechanics, I can do that. Click OK. Now I've got a new group called mechanics. The little gray box here with the zero in it means there's zero employees in that group. Maintenance here has five, so I know there's five employees in my maintenance group, but I've got none in mechanics. And if I click view staff, sure enough, you'll see that none come up. If I wanna add staff to my mechanic group, I simply click the staff I wanna add and I can do one or two or any number. Click the staff groups button and say add to staff group. I'll pick mechanics. And I'll click OK. Now when I go back to staff groups, under mechanics, there's two. And if I go view staff, it's going to show me my two staff members that are a member of the mechanics group. Groups have the most usefulness for your foreman in the field. It helps them find employees faster. For instance, if I was a foreman filling out a timesheet, all the staff might be a long list. But if you set up groups in your company, a foreman could pick Instead of all staff, a maintenance for instance, that list would get filtered down to just the employees that belong to the maintenance group, which may help me find Josh faster. And now that I select Josh, he shows up here. So groups are a way to make it faster for employees in the field to find information. And there's a couple other areas of the application which you can use groups to filter down your list of employees.